Hello to the YouTubes and things. I need to find a controller. I feel like it's going to die on us tonight. It's been a little while since I've uh, plugged it in. Um, Insert, saving and loading, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. That's fine. Default's fine. I've never played the game before, so. Just making them on your arm for a minute and you're trying to glue. What? Do you not like her spending time with you? Is that the problem? Do you not love the cat anymore? I don't <laughs> I don't see the problem here, Noodle. What's wrong? You always think it's cute when she's all up my butt and I'm trying to eat food or something. So <laughs> stop her, you mean? Maybe you should have. All I'm saying. Also, this game is loud AF. Holy shit. Jesus Christ, dude. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. Hold Veronica X. I think I need to just turn down the console in general a bit. That is loud as fuck. Okay, options. It definitely looks like the older Resident Evil games as far as like the stuff goes here. Is it? No. I don't think I have this one for the Dreamcast. I don't know. Whatever. Uh, screen setup. Looks fine. Monitor adjustment. Looks good. Vibration on. Yeah, everything's fine. Looks good to me. Resident okay. Evil. Resident Evil. The back of the case makes this game look terrible. Like <laughs> the American Midwestern town, Raccoon City, has been completely decimated due to the T virus outbreak that was instigated by the international corporation Umbrella. Claire Redfield, who arrived in Raccoon City to search for her lost brother Chris and a rookie police officer, Leon S. Kennedy, managed to escape from the city. But their ordeal was only a prelude of things to come. Are the residents evil? Probably. Three months later. I have a sneaking suspicion they are zombies or something similar. Percy Jackson show? Yeah, we'll probably end up watching it. Most likely. number is WKD4496. <sighs> Welcome to your new home. Her name is Claire Redfield. We caught her trespassing in our Paris lab facility 10 days ago. She apparently infiltrated the complex looking for her lost brother, Chris Redfield, one of the surviving members of RPD's famous STARS teams. So was this like transitionary period, you know, they're trying to be more action-y, but also trying to be classic Resident Evil? That's the vibe it's given off to me at least. Bro, them dudes got fucked. I love how she can just outrun a helicopter. And also, apparently, these dudes have never heard of, like, leading their shots. <laughs> this looks fine. That's not some cheesy ass fucking action movie shit, dude. <laughs> like, <laughs> don't move. Who is that dude?
Guessing not friendly, based off of, like, the fact it seems like we're in some sort of war zone right now. <laughs> war, war zone prison? I don't... I don't know what this is. That's our father? <laughs> Obviously, yeah. <laughs> of course. Okay, yeah, we're locked up. Oh. Fuck. Sorry. I'm guessing they want us to think zombie, but he's just like sick. Got a bit of the, the stomach virus going on. Maybe a bit of food poisoning. We're equipped with a lighter I could see outside. Okay. Okay. It's a menu's pretty similar to older. I almost said older Call of Duties. What the fuck? Resident Evil games. All right, well, I I do have a lighter. A Redfield, five and a half foot. 115 pounds. Blood type O. Very fancy. What's the little symbol there for, though? Text the materials. Ah. What was, what was this? Oh, manual. Nah, that's fine. I don't think we need to. Okay. You can wander your cage and you have wonderful zombie protection? I mean, true. True. Just got to get that like consistent food and water because I'm pretty sure the zombies could outweigh you. Perfect. That's say. Go on. Get out of here. This place is finished. I don't know. It might have been a special forces team, but in any case, this prison's been taken over. Troops are being wiped out. What are you saying? You're free to leave the complex. But you may as well know you have no chance of getting off this island. And what about you? What are you going to do? Don't worry about me. Okay, I won't. Uh <laughs> Okay, cool. We have tank controls. X does nothing, square nothing. Okay. Triangles map. Circle nothing, at least not yet. Some of these buttons will probably do things once we get. Sorry. Is right stick down? Uh, items? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. R3. R3 is items. Menu. That's weird. Yeah, I would definitely take the green herb, though. Thank you for that game. Been a little while since I played a tank control Resident Evil game. This might take a second. Can we inspect the bottle? A hemostatic capsule is on the floor. It's empty. So he is bitten by a zombie, I'm guessing. And gun bullets? Yes. Thank you. We take, like, some clothes. List of prisoners. My name is at the end. WKD4496, Claire Redfield. Escort name... The escort's name is at the end of the document. Umbrella Medical Paris, third security unit leader. Rodrigo Juan Raval. Ah, he's an escort. That makes a lot of sense now. Uh, I didn't. don't need to read all this again. I was just trying to inspect. Is that a knife? Knife would probably be nice. And me. Okay, well, we can talk to him. Is he going to, like, attack us? His eyes are closed. He's bleeding. I'll need hemostatic medicine. Are we going to try and save him? I mean, he did kind of save us. That nice. Nice if we could get, like, an actual weapon, like a gun. A gun would be nice. I can't help but wonder, like, is this survival or is this action? Which one? Do I need to conserve bullets? 
Or do I need to just kill everything I come across? We probably won't die right away. It's fine. I take it back. We're gonna save. <laughs> I don't care about raiding anyways. Uh, yeah. Save progress. Ink ribbon. Curing space. I have no idea, like, anything about this game, really. But I'm already liking it more than Resident Evil 4. <laughs> Oh, what can I say? I just, I like old Resident Evil games. Man, I don't know. Okay, space secured. Uh, yeah, save his name. So, wait, wait, did it, like, make space for every file on the memory card? And not just, like, the ones we use, or as we use them? What is that? Is that a broken lamp? Interact with this thing on the wall? Switch or whatever? No. Seem like it. Okay. Can we run? Okay, holding circle run. That could very well be important. Soon. It's our heart beating so hard. We're just going up some stairs, man. Chill. Oh. Can we put away the lighter, maybe... A knife instead. Okay, how do we attack? I would really like to know how to attack. R1 square, R1 and square, okay. Or X. X or square, okay. Hmm, touching that would probably be bad for us. That looks awfully zappy. <laughs> Truck used for transport. transport. Oil is leaking from the crash wreck. A dead body and a briefcase can be seen inside. Can we get the briefcase? If they're a transport truck, they might have been armed. Depending, like, what they're transporting. What? Jesus Christ, okay. Hey, look, it's a chest! And a dead dude! Well, undead dude. This combat tutorial time? What if we hadn't grabbed the knife? Oh. <laughs> oh shit, yeah, I didn't even think about the fact that we're in a graveyard right now. I'm sure it's fine. Wait, can they be infected post-death? I thought the whole thing was like you had to be infected before death and then die. Is this canon? Are we sure we're not just tripping on LSD right now or something, man? And Dr... What was his name? Rodrigo? I don't remember what it was. Did he do a little something something to us? Oh god, I wasn't ready. Um... No? <laughs> oh god. Okay. Uh, I can't run over them? Okay. I'm really glad we saved. I want to get that chest. Maybe if we leave. Sometimes in these games, like, if you leave and come back, zombies will despawn or spawn in a different place or something, so. Let's just go in here. God damn it. I'm not a zombie, or was that, like, an automatic turret? It might be automatic. No, okay, there's a dude there. What? Don't shoot. Who are you? Huh? You're not a zombie. Well, great. Wait right there. I'm coming over. Ah, uh, 
sorry about that little misunderstanding. Don't worry. But I thought you were another one of those mo- Shut up. Make one wrong move and I'll shoot. Relax, beautiful. I said I was sorry. My name's Steve. I was a prisoner on this island. And I'm guessing you're not from Umbrella either. No, I'm Claire. Claire Redfield. Claire? Hmm. Nice. I'll remember that. Hey, I heard there's an airport around here. And once I find it, I can finally escape from this crazy island. Well, I'll see ya. Hey, wait up! I don't want you following me, lady. Sorry, we're Don't stalker. Oh good, this game realizes that having companions sucks ass. If only they would have learned that lesson before Resident Evil Zero. You've taken the handgun! Uh, wait, where did we come from? We came from over here? I just want to know where that dude's from. Like, who's, who? What accent was that? <laughs> like, it sounded like pretty normal more or less American speech, except for the sorry. Okay, well, it's auto-aiming all the way over there, which is interesting. How many shots does it take to kill? Four. Oh, that one missed. Oh, never mind. It's not in... Ah, it's shit. You know what? It's fine. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Reload! Oh, wait, did it reload already? He's a fellow Wisconsinite, yeah. Are you alive? Look alive to me. I don't know, you guys got things of blood. Why are your bodies still moving, though? I'm gonna run out of ammo so quick. Are you bleeding? You're bleeding. Okay. Wait, where'd the chest go? Oh, there it is. Oh, fuck. Ah, I came all the way back here for nothing. Son of a bitch. And I just like... Does the fire actually hurt? We're gonna end up dying. Who the fuck makes R3 <laughs> the button to get into the menu here? That is... Oh. Uh... It's raining! I guess it's because it's like oil that's on fire, but... Something back here in the corner? No, guess not. This is a dark game. I could totally play this. Apparently a dust box? Why apparently a dust box? Why not just a dust box? Completely nailed down, it's impossible to open it. Question of the day! You're trapped in your favorite video game for 24 hours. What game is it and what item would be most essential for survival? I, uh, am having a hard time picking between Kingdom Hearts 2 and Stardew Valley and Final Fantasy 7 for favorite game. Um, but honestly, for like all of those games, wouldn't really need anything specific. They have pretty standard worlds, you know, for the most part. Like, as long as you're not in a world in Kingdom Hearts that's getting eaten by the darkness, you're good, man. You just live your life like normal. Um, Final Fantasy VII? I mean, there's monsters. I guess, like, a dope-ass gun? <laughs> I would say sword, but honestly, I feel like a gun would be better for me. Um, and then in uh, Stardew Valley, like, it's a farm. <laughs> Having a farm would be really nice. Or a shop. Uh, a pickaxe, maybe? Like I said, with the Hymn of Faith on it. Perfect. Perfect. I wish they would have explored that a bit more. Because I'm just curious. Like, Does that work? No, okay. Like, is that... Would that have actually worked? Like, if, if he was coming for you, if someone was coming for you, and someone just started singing the Hymn of the Faith... Would, uh, would he just, like, chill out, relax a little bit? These are the questions that keep me up at night. Uh, 
Uh, I'm assuming it's same as normal. I don't remember the exact like mix guide. Is it? It's what three greens for a full heal, and then two, a red and a green for a full heal. I think is what it is. I think at least. Random materials are piled up. Nothing useful. Garbage. Literally. Ah, you're a body. Oh. <laughs> Well, <laughs> there's a big hole in the wire netting. There's a blood stain under. Well, yeah, I saw like what happened. I was hoping we could like peek under. Honestly, are they like gonna come out? Whatever the fuck it was. No. Ah, oh, we can go in here. I probably should have went in the building. I'm sure there's something there, but. I'm gonna say no because the hymn is always sung at the temples and that didn't help kill Kamut. That seems like a bit of a plot hole, but you have a point. Hi, friends. I'm gonna check the other building. <laughs> uh, you're a lot of zombies. I have a handgun with very limited ammo. I mean, I do have a knife, but I don't trust the knife much. Oh, oh, they're dogs. Fuck me. Okay. Hopefully the dogs are easy to, to dodge in this one. Uh, go in, please. <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. Zombie dogs are the worst. Oh, God. There's so many zombies. No, not that one. Aim at this one. Bro, what is wrong with you? Why would you aim at that one? Okay. Oh, ammo. We're also starting to get hurt, though. I can't see... Anybody? Okay. Wait, is he dead? He's dead. Give me ammo. Probably gonna use more ammo than this, just clearing the room though. I don't know if this is the best idea. Half eaten food items are scattered in this area. Very handy, thank you for that game. Toilet has some rather disgusting stains. A horrible smell lingers. Is there nothing useful in here? That's not. No, oh, fuck you. Ah, fuck you. <laughs> Your friend died in three shots. Why didn't you? Which way did we... I think we came in through that door. Now, there was another one up here. I keep pressing triangle for items, but triangle's map. Uh, we're just in yellow. We're fine. Another green herb. There's another green herb. Oink. It's normally just Sung the Faith that is the Aeon, so maybe he didn't hear... True. True. Got to get like a boom box to go with that cassette. How did you get down here? I didn't think you guys could work stairs. Is that a note? Taking the prism. Oh. <laughs> Someone didn't finish their soup. It's still a bit. Well, I'll finish the soup. I love soup. Playing ring around the rosy with this dude. Wait, what's through this door? Fine, yes. Could have refilled ammo wise in there, but. Are you dead? I don't know if I trust that you're dead. Prisoner's Diary. May 13th, this room stinks to death. Pa uh, based upon the information I found, I believe that I'm far south of the equator. Lucky for me that Bob in the bunk below me is one of those interesting types of guys. May 16th, today Bob told some crazy story of why he was put this place with me. Why he was put this place with me. Okay, I didn't misread that. I thought I had a mini stroke. Bob said that he used to be an attendant of the head of this place. This boss named Alfred supposedly placed him in here because of a tiny little mistake. What does that mean? What's going to happen to me? May 20th, without warning, a group of military men took Bob to the building behind the guillotine stand. At midnight, I'll sneak out of here to see him. I've been hearing that anyone taken to that building never comes back. On top of that, there are these really large plastic bags constantly being removed from that place. I'd better pray for Bob. Did Bob get guillotine? I mean, you literally called it the guillotine building. So... 
was wrong. I shouldn't have gone there. What is going on in there? All I could hear was some insanely creepy laughter and the sound of Bob screaming. I don't know what to do. I can't stop thinking about it. Is that going to happen to me? I can't let it. I just can't. May 27th. Since my last entry, all my fellow inmates have been taken to that building. I know that I am next. It's obvious that we were all here to be used as Alfred's guinea pigs. There's no way out. What am I going to do? File the prisoner. Oh, the building behind the guillotine. So sorry. I misspoke. But still, guillotine. Yes, I, I agree. Oh, hi, friend. Can I shoot you through the window? Or... I guess that's a no. Oh, wait, did he just drop guns? Oh shit, hi! Where did you come from? You're gonna get my feet, aren't you? You bastard. Uh, shoot. Oh, there's another one? Bruh, I shot you four times. Why do you suck? <laughs> Fuck these guys. What's my health at? Is it red yet? That's uh, still in blue. Uh, this is not worth whatever's over here. Wait, are these like akimbo SMGs? <laughs> Bro, <laughs> did I take it back? What the fuck? Sick, okay. But I noticed that it's just sitting at 100% and not like an actual ammo count. So I wonder if it's a limited item, ammo item. Okay, this ended up being well worth it, even though we lost a shit ton of health. Well, I guess we didn't actually lose all that much health, but we took a lot of hits. We're still in caution. We're still in yellow. I can't help but notice, too, it didn't ask, uh... Like, a difficulty or anything, did it? Oh, start also brings us here. That's good to know. M100P, okay. Semi-automatic pistol, which has a large size special magazine. This handgun enables precise rapid shooting with little recoil. Be fancy. We'll save that though. I was curious if we could get into options. Hmm. No subs. Okay. That's all I really wanted to know. So now to the other building? I'm assuming it's the guillotine building. I guess we have a map now. Does it say? No, no, it does not. Okay. Are the dogs still here? Or... Have I just heard one? They're gonna pop out again? Ah, oh, you bastard. Run away. Is it just the one or? Okay, I was half expecting another one to be there as soon as I came around the corner, but we're good. Now there are dudes here though. Are you dead or are you gonna get my foot? You're gonna get my foot. Bro, why aren't you dead? Oh my God. <laughs> why does it take so many shots to kill some of these dudes? Five, six, seven, eight, nine. <laughs> My God, is this other one dead? He is. Uh, this looks chained. Yeah, nailed. Whatever. Anything in the trash? We press this. Which controls the outer outdoor shut? <laughs> Why not, man? Oh, it appears to be locked. Okay. Ah, oh, fuck. Dead. Uh, we're in orange. For all that ammo we just collected, though. It's like gone. <laughs> Holy shit. Well, only one way to go. 
definitely seems more like the survival kind of uh, Resident Evil. What's this one do? At least switch to the metal detector. The deactivation lamp is on. Please deposit any metallic items you have in the security box. No? Wait, what? Yes, push this. Oh, wait. Um, do we want it locked down in here? I any metallic items you have in the security box. I don't know. Let's run through it first. Because it's possible we won't be able to get somewhere. Um. Yeah, okay. Let me just, like... Bro. Why can't I just, like... Ah, throw my stuff through. Hit the fucking button. And then walk through with nothing. Why do I gotta put shit in the box? Don't. Wait, does the lighter count? Fuck. Okay, lighter counts even. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Push the damn switch. I heard you the first time, lady. Alright. Take the lighter, too. I don't trust all these bros by the windows. Ooh. Killing spray. Yeah, I'll take the first aid. Okay. What is this? Roll panel with a 3D scanner. There's an activation switch. Or enhanced 3D scanner. Please place the material you wish to have scanned on the scanner portion of the. Um, auto duplicator. If the materials are set, it can. I can restore the object. What is this shit? Okay. Oh, those are shotgun shells, aren't they? Yeah. Oh, can we mix so shotgun shells in this one? Gas rounds? Wait, is there a shotgun around here somewhere? Can I place... ...material to be scanned? Um... Use. Too big in size, it cannot be set. Use. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> That's not what I was trying to do. Ah, oh, whatever. Remember when you're going through your times on PlayStation? Turns out those are horribly inaccurate. PlayStation times on Tekken 7 is 715 hours when true time played is 250. Why is it so crazy inaccurate? That's like very inaccurate. That's insane. I mean, 250 is still a lot, but 250 is like, I feel like reasonable for, for a game you really like that you've played a lot of, you know? 715 is obsession level. Facts on the facility access application. Oh, that's kind of stupid. <laughs> If that's how that works, that's really dumb, man. There's somebody actually here? Chris oh. Redfield. Where the game doesn't count menu time. What are you doing here? That sounds more likely. But that's a Chris lot of Redfield. menu time. Although I guess if you left Is it on for a bit, then or something? Yeah. You mean my brother? Ah, your siblings. Well, it seems your brother is under surveillance by Umbrella. What? A 
got to contact Leon and tell him to let my brother know he's being monitored. It's a good thing I have access to an outside connection from here. Well, that file shows the latitude and longitude of this place. <laughs> Why don't you send your brother the coordinates and ask him to come help? Thanks. I'll do that. Hey, I was just kidding. There's no way he could get here, even if he is your brother. Yes, he can. I'm sure of it. No way. He won't come. You'll just end up disappointed if you rely on others. Believe me, I know. Somebody has abandonment issues. What was that all about? Ooh, save. We should probably. Vibrate. Well, yeah, I know. I was trying to look at this file. Oh, <laughs> okay. I was looking at the file, but sure, I'll take the hawk emblem. Uh, is there not a ribbon? Oh, it's a proper one, too. A full key. Yes, one now. Please and thank. It'd be real handy if we could, like, close the shutters ourselves, but preferably just the shutters, not, like, the big metal door. Because I'm pretty sure those things are going to make their way through at some point. The windows. Dr. Leon has been sent. There's got to be a shotgun around here somewhere, right? Uh, sure. Pull the lever up. I mean, that unlocked this door. Oh. No. <clears throat> Never mind. What did that lever do? It wasn't like already open, was it? And I'm just a dumbass? Oh no, okay. Lock has been released. Hmm. Great. There's zombies. Uh, and I do not have a weapon. I had to leave all my shit. Any metallic items you have in the security box. Like I, had, I was kind of hoping there'd be like a zombie in there and he would get smooshed. Not gonna lie. Um, okay. The emblem looks... Metallic? I guess I should check. Yeah, remove the switch. Remove the switch. Please deposit any metallic. Fuck you, game. In the security box. Okay. Definitely counts. I mean, I guess it could be the ink ribbon. But I don't think ink ribbons would count as Please metallic, right? Any metallic items you have I mean, they're held in like a little metal case, but... Fuck, for real, dude? Okay. So wait, I guess... I guess the Hawk Emblem could be fine? Oh fuck, the first aid spray too, huh? Fuck it, I guess we're just leaving everything. Get fucked us. Surprisingly, nobody came out. Uh, guess I'll go ahead and take everything. Hmm, but where the fuck did we go from here? Was there a locked door anywhere that we... Couldn't get past? Oh, it was this, wasn't it? Ah, <laughs> uh, excuse me. Yeah, push the switch. What's gonna be on the other side of this? Zombra! Oh, God. Uh. Okay. Can I reload room? Will reloading the room help? 
I mean, I could use our good gun. But I'd rather not if we don't have to. I don't know how much ammo there actually is. Now, oh, fuck. What is this thing? Huh. Fire extinguisher. Sure. Oh, fire extinguisher. Of course. Aw, oh, damn it. You have a pretty good range on you, don't you? Uh, we'll come back to you, maybe, or not. Really wish we had the first aid spray. Oh, hey, it's the guillotine! Padlock key? Oh, the padlock key! Okay. Okay, some sort of emblem, but obviously don't have whatever we need to get into that. No, oh, fuck. Jesus Christ. All of you? I'm hurt. I have nothing to heal. This is fun. Great. I'm sure, I'm sure there won't be any problems. The padlock's on the other side. Hi, dog. Find me, doggy. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, God. Wait, where, where were we going? Uh, this isn't where I was trying to go, but... Oh, God. Uh, yes, discard. Keep running, just keep running. Did we lose him? I think we lost him. Where's he gonna come from? Okay. Good, the dogs do suck in this game. So here, it's here. Good to know. Watch we end up dying to a dog. <laughs> Somebody sounds squishy. Oh, fuck you guys! There's so many zombies. I thought I killed you all. Are there going to be more in here? Fuck, there is. Oh, shit. Okay. Uh, fire extinguisher. Ooh. Is it medicine by any chance for the dude? Taking the briefcase. Uh, I mean, that's fancy and all, but check. There's a button. EG01. <laughs> it's also, okay, it's an alloy. Product description. Thank you for your continued support and for using our products. So this time we have gathered our most advanced technologies and have succeeded in creating the unique anti-metal detection alloy. Oh, TG01. Cannot be detected by any metal detectors. Cannot be pictured by... Yep. <laughs> Lightweight yet durable. Plan to develop various weapons utilizing this innovative new alloy. We have enclosed a sample for you to review. We look forward to hearing from you, from you regarding possible business opportunities. Metal Industries Go. Okay. So I'm guessing we can use that to make a weapon that can go through the metal detector. Which is all fine and dandy. But, as of right now, we have no way of getting a weapon through to the duplicator thing. <sighs> but we're still kind of fucked. Is bro still down here? Curious if he's become zombified or... Anything, really. Halfing, ex halfing. I'm half expecting him to just be gone. I don't know, he's still here. Oh, he's got a gun now. I mean, it's dark to make anything out. Oh, he's breathing, too. <coughs> oh, I don't care about the list of fucking prisoners. Eyes are closed. He's... Fuck. 
Why am I coughing so much? I mean, he's moved from last time. He's definitely breathing. I could try to talk to him. That's not, though. Oh, fuck. Ugh. I'm guessing we're going to have to save him at some point, though. Either that or he's going to become a person that we have to deal with. One or the other. God. Um, okay, you know what? We're gonna try the knife, I think. I don't expect the knife to go well for me. I've never been good with a knife in Resident Evil games, but... God damn it. <laughs> Get him in the knees! Get him in the knees! <gasps> Did it actually work? Get fucked! Jesus Christ! I did not think that was gonna work. Jack, what's up, man? Welcome! Come on. No, I can probably get around you. No, I can't. I lied. Get him. Get him. Cut his legs off. Get his knees! No! <laughs> And we were one hit away. Oh, fuck. Did you just today? I mean, that was last night, technically. No, didn't we listen to it? Under the Tree is a uh, song by Sim for uh, Attack on Titan, by the way, for anybody that cares. Anyways, no, wasn't there like a leaked version that came out months ago that we listened to or something? It just popped up when I was on YouTube last night and gave me some feels because of the game. Or the game? The, the show. Uh, wish we had something to heat with. Guess we'll equip the good gun and just see how it goes. Oh, cool. We can shoot two people at the same time. You're... Okay, you're dead. I know it came out two months ago, but I feel like we heard it long before that. So just killing two zombies took 92, or 92%, 8%. So it's like 4% per zombie, which isn't great. Especially since I don't even know where we're going right now. Gate of the prison. Oh, okay. So we need to get, we need to get the hawk symbol copied, not the guns. But then what's the point of the the shotgun ammo that we got unless shotgun ammo is not metallic somehow oh fuck you oh fuck you oh god okay they can come under the building go in go in oh uh, maybe that's what i was thinking of then the shortened version i don't know maybe i did just now listen to the full version then Dead? I can't tell if you're dead. I think you're dead. Oh, fuck. Lead? Lead, okay. Her health at. Still kicking, just barely. Okay, so the hawk symbol doesn't go there, which is what I originally thought. Now there's going to be zombies in here. It's got to happen at some point. They break through the window, right? Please deposit any metallic items you have in the security box. Pause it. Let's try. No, we'll leave it. The ammo doesn't do me any good anyways. If uh, I don't have a gun. Oh, wait, the lighter. Almost forgot the lighter. I do not trust those things. I do not trust them one bit. Uh, grab the ammo. 
Okay, the ammo does count as metal. I mean, I figured as much, but... I mean, I feel safer with the gate down anyways, so... I guess grab the first aid spray, too. We are pretty hurt. Might as well go ahead and use it. Uh, wrong button. Okay. So, I'm assuming... That's the material to be scanned. So... This? And then... Transmission complete. Auto duplicate. Okay, yeah. And then... Undetectable metal alloy. <laughs> Hell yeah. This makes a lot more sense than a gun, though. I was wondering, like, how would it be able to scan the insides of the gun? Duplication complete. So yeah, this this makes more sense. Yeah, I'll take the alloy emblem. No nothing in here, right? I don't see the point in going in there. Um. I hit the switch and then run like hell and pray. Literally cannot believe they haven't broken out. I'll take it. Uh, what are the chances we're going to need the fire extinguisher again? Will it say, like, empty or something if we check it? It does say empty. Must fill it with the extinguishant before I can... Okay. Never mind. It seems to be a reusable item. Hmm. <laughs> so, Optijack, have you ever played this one? This Resident Evil game? My first time playing it, I believe. They respawn again? At least one of them did. It might be, like, dumb to kill everybody. Oh, it's the dog. The dog's fine. We'll just run past him. Dog's no, no bueno. He's fine. Yeah, everybody's respawning. Son of a bitch, dude. Hmm. So if we can run past people, just run past people. Conserve the ammo. Hopefully these ones are dead still. They're not. Ah, fuck. Thought I could get past you. Is it like Resident Evil 1 Remake where we have to... Wait. Wait, I went to the wrong spot. It was that last area we need to be in. Um, oh, god damn it. <laughs> I, can't, I can't fucking dodge to save my life. Uh, no, aim at the one in front of you. Whatever, he turned around anyways. I don't even remember what I was saying. Oh, where you have to, like, burn the bodies to actually kill them. And where's this gate? Not this one, is it? No. I literally ran into him. It's fine. Fine. Now I'm stuck to him. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. You're not dead. Oh, you are dead. You? Okay. I'm about to be. Uh, yes. Picture of a hawk. What's on the other side of door number one? We have a black void. No, uh, completely destroyed door. 
like another destroyed door. A road that's blocked by a conveniently placed vehicle. Or inconveniently in our case, I guess. That also has some ammo in the front seat. Oh, some herbs. A couple herbs. We have like no inventory space. I can climb up here. Okay. It's not helpful at all, but good to know. I know I can't proceed. I want I want the ammo. Yes, take the handgun bullet. Is that it? Can I like drop something and then pick it back up? No. I really wanted to combine these herbs, but um I like I guess I should have just left the manual in the box. Uh ba -ba um Fuck. I hate using herbs when they're not like full. Also, we need the fire extinguisher to get through here, don't we? So wait, what the fuck? Can I push the box? Ooh, okay. Wait, for real? Can't just like make that step diagonally there, <laughs> bro. What? Does it go any, no, it won't go any farther. Maybe I can push it into this fire though. Yeah, okay. Box gets too hot to climb on now, like. Up and up and up we go. Mm. You don't look friendly. Did I kill? I think I can get past. They're in a convenient place. It, oh god, okay. They did a good job making the game much darker to the point of like not being able to see shit. Like those zombies just popped up out of nowhere. That was actually a pretty good effect. They should use that more. That sounds like a dog. Yup. Ah oh, fuck. <laughs> Called it. <laughs> it didn't kill us though. Okay. God, we need killing stuff. No, you bastard. Okay, just run. Wait, there's something on the ground. I, I can't leave whatever's on the ground on the ground. Oh, wait, are there more? More. The navy proof. That go in. That other door. I don't suppose there's like a box around here somewhere, is there? I could drop some shit off so I could pick up some heals. Wonder what happens if I try to pick it up. Can I just like use it? Can't take any more items, use it now. I mean I guess. We're pretty close to death, so I feel like we don't have much of an option. Oh, that actually healed us pretty well. Maybe I'm wasting them by combining them. Before I go in this door, we came in from that side. So if we go this way, what is this over here? Hmm. Water zombies? Question mark? Ammo. Ammo's nice. Yeah, you know, we probably have enough now to not keep using the really good weapon. 
Back to the pistol. I'm guessing this is another map. Palace map. We're at the palace. Iron bridge. Okay. So that must be the big building that we were just at, the palace. That. Are those arrows? What are you? Oh. Noctonical Hollow, you say? Navy proof? Oh. What? Really? One, two, three, four, five, six. What do you mean there's no... Whatever. Construction material. Hmm. Okay. Well. Seems the only place to go is the palace. So. Hop in the palace. They want to respawn all this, right? No, but their bodies are gone, which bugs me more. Hmm. <laughs> this place doesn't give me the creeps at all. That dude missing his head? Ah, fuck. There goes my controller. I knew it was going to die tonight, man. It felt like it had been too long. All right, BRB. Okay, so we probably need that to get up there. Oh, there's a memory, though. Let's check that out first. Oh, wait. Nito Corporation? Nito. Oh, Neko. Ah, because that's cat in Japanese. <laughs> they were responsible for waste management. As trash from the upper lo levels overloaded the slums, they tried to develop a bacteria to dissolve it all. That's where the Zerk came from. After the humans disappeared, that bacteria mutated, growing, eating away more than trash. And now we have Zerks. Let's go. Yeah, that sounds about right, dude. Humans fuck everything up. Okay, so how do we, well, since they always like run straight for you, basically. Can't tell if it's charging or not. <laughs> I have it plugged into my light because I forgot that I had a cord like going from my light over to here. But like normally it turns yellow whenever it's charging and it didn't. But it's on. It hasn't turned itself back off yet. So maybe it's fine. Uh, Anyways. Wow to you, my guy. Sorry. Wow. I will take, please. What I really want is a box. Somewhere to store shit, you know? For the back talk? To Jack, just Fine, I have some wonderful root beer and whiskey, so... It is delicious. So thank you for the drink. All right, I want to go get a closer look at this thing up here. This. Huge portrait is on display. Does he have a head? <laughs> the game makes, like, seeing things kind of hard. Everything's kind of hazy. Um, okay. What all do we have down here? There's the door in the back here. Electronically locked. Can we interact with this computer screen at all? Security lock system is active. Enter an employee ID to activate the unlocking device. Please enter your ID number. Um, 1987. Enter. Doodle, thank you for the five bits. I appreciate you, love. Verification has been rejected. 
Um. Five, six, one. I don't even know how many digits. I'm just <laughs> clicking things. But imagine if we guessed it, though. Okay. Are these doors? They look like doors, but it just says nothing used. And what about this one? Is it locked? It's not. Could be useful. I don't know. We have almost a demon mice, zombie mice. No, do not use the spray right now. Oh, it's a bat. Are they the evil? They are evil. Damn you, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, well, maybe we will use the spray. Hmm. The inventory thing is really a problem, game. It... Oh. <laughs> oh, defeat. Okay. I thought... I thought Chocobo was going to instantly unbreed her. What's she look like now? Okay, so same like green and gray, but with the big eyes. Well, we're probably going to need that suitcase. Or whatever the fuck it was. But until I find a box to put stuff in, I really don't want to run all the way back to the metal detecting box. If they, like, want to put a save room up here, but, like, a normal save room with boxes and shit. <coughs> hey, look, a save room. <laughs> What's this? Secretary's note. Four years have passed since I began serving Sir Alfred, and he doesn't trust anyone. Even though I am his attendant, I'm still strictly prohibited from entering his private house. What is this problem, anyway? They say he lives with his twin sister, Alexia, in his private house on the hill. Occasionally, I've seen someone standing by the window of the house. Might have been Alexia, whose extreme beauty is often talked about. I once asked Sir Alfred about this, but it only enraged him. Even though I am his attendant, he will not show me any lenience if I ask about her again. I could put my life at risk. My god, dude. Bro's, like, insane. After all, it is a mystery why he so desperately tries to keep his private life with Alexia a secret. Is that why he's doing, like, all of this experimentation on people? Like, trying to fix her or bring her back to life or something? Or I don't even have enough room. Oh, that's a box. Okay, thank fuck. Yes, take the bullet. Box me, daddy. Thank you. Uh, knife. Empty extinguisher. I feel like we're gonna need the navy proof soon. Probably won't need that. And I'm going to try to live without the good gun for a bit. Yes, I will take the ribbon, please. Yeah, I just got to remember not to lie. I'm like sitting back very comfortably now. But <laughs> remember not to knock my drink over. That would be bad time. Yes. Who's the ink ribbon? So Optijack, does watching this slash me playing this make you want to bring back your podcast? When are we going to have return of the, the Gaming Gear podcast, man? After the, what was it, three year hiatus? Four? Has it been four years? It's been a while. Oh, shiny. Evidence that the shelf has been moved. <laughs> the furry feet episode return. I was thinking more like Resident Evil, but I mean, if that's what you want to do, man. As long as you're the one streaming it, I'm down. Oh, wait, you didn't want to stream recording the episodes, huh? Forgot about that. 
Got an ID card. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, ID card. That might have an employee nev blah, 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 number. Ah, that's a lot of numbers. <laughs> NTC zero three nine four. So is it just 0394 that we need? I don't know that's a commitment recording footage, I mean. <laughs> just play the game while you talk about it then. Problem solved. Yes, take the earth. What is this? Locked. Two guns. No, not the two that we have, okay. What was it? Was it 0394? Zero, zero, 0294? I don't know. And besides that, man, I could record the footage if it's too much of a commitment for you. <laughs> you know, my God, my guy. <laughs> just what I do when I record footage for podcasts is I just record the audio. And if it's a game I'm streaming, me talking on separate tracks. That way you can just have the game audio and not the, the voiceover. Oh fuck, it's like a full keyboard. Was it NT0394? Uh, or was it like NTC? Fuck! I don't have a memory game. Why, <laughs> why are you making me do this? Can I just use it? No. NTC 0394. Okay. I had it. Uh, N. N4. Please, for the love of fuck. Let's go. Security lock system is deactivated. That seems like a bad thing for us, honestly. Yeah, discard it. Um, Before we go through that door, though, I feel like we should explore the rest of the upstairs. Kind of ignored one half of it. Something thrilling about not wanting to play RE1 back to back like that and only having like a day left before recording, not gonna lie. <laughs> oh my god. The word crest, okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> I don't know, man. I didn't mind. I feel like I didn't mind as much as you playing it back to back like we did Resident Evil 1. Because the second playthrough was, like, so much easier than the first. I might have literally played it on easy mode, though. I don't remember. Uh, hold on. Can I get around the Zombros? Oh, that's locked. Okay, so we're back to, like, proper crest systems. Christ, you take a lot of shots to kill. Which character did you play? Uh, I think we did it opposite too, but I do not remember, to be honest, which one I did. I think I did... Who were the two in the first one? Was it Chris and somebody? Chris and... Uh... What was the other one? I think I did Chris first. Though. Jill, that's it. Fuck you! Why can we not, like... ...shove before they attack? That'd be super handy. Locked gold crest, okay. They're really channeling, like, Resident Evil 1 here, man. With, like, the different colored keys. Now it's crests. Oh! Is, are these the, the guns? And I like 
Yeah, with their thick ass inventory, and then you have Chris who uses his back fucking pocket or something to carry shit. I mean, what else is he supposed to use? It's not like he has a big combat vest with pockets out the ass. We really not take any of the buttons. Okay, I see the blinking thing. I'm assuming that's what we need to interact with, but ammo. Dual modeled after an ant is the button below. Yeah, push the button. Why not? Oh, <laughs> we get to watch a movie? Let's go. Wasn't it Chris who had, like, the lighter as a permanent item or something, though? Whereas Joe didn't? Or something along them lines, right? We can punch boulders. Yeah, it seems legit. Is our guy making some kind of fucked up potion? Or no, oh, he's feeding it to the ants. Okay. Never mind, that's not as morbid as I thought. Maybe still a little bit. Okay, that is too close for twins. They're in love, are they not? Are they gonna kiss, bro? <laughs> I think there's some cousin loving going on here. <laughs> or cousin loving? Sister loving. Why they look like they should be at Hogwarts? Mm. Uh, I mean, sure. English, I guess. <laughs> Alabama Hogwarts, yes. There we go. Now I agree with you. Yeah, fuck. What's behind the tank? Uh. Ooh. Okay, so this is the thing that we need to, to control that thing outside. Guns from many countries are in display here, but let's not take any of them, because why would we do that? Ooh. Yes, take the gold lugers. Oh. Oh. Oh, God. Bro. Oh, it's like the gold shotgun, isn't it? Yeah, put them back. Wasn't it? Or was it a gold shotgun? There was some sort of shotgun or something in the one game, wasn't there? Where, like, the thing just fell down and killed you? Oh, yeah, this part had me pissed. Wait, so you have played this game before? I haven't played this one. This is my first time ever playing this one. But I need that for the room. Um. Ah, oh, so not very far. Okay. I think. I think we probably just come back. To Because, like, we have the one item that we can use to, like, in the water area or whatever. So, yeah. Maybe we just come back. Let's leave. Oh, fuck, wrong way. You need to play more, but you played it directly after beating 3 Remake and was kind of burnt out on Resident Evil. Yeah, you have this weird tendency of just playing games, like, back to back to back, man. I don't... Like, in one series. I can't do that. It's the same thing whenever I, like, read books and stuff, too. I'll, like, you know, read one from one series. Even if I own five of them. I'll read one book from the series and then go on to the next. To a different series, I mean. And then repeat. Was that a red herb? That was a red herb. I mean, gimme, please. Uh, mix? I'm pretty sure that's a four. Memory serves. What is this? Oh, silver crap. Forget shit and you hate when they make callbacks and you don't remember it? I don't know, man. I guess I'm just old enough at this point that I've come to accept that. <laughs> it's just a fact of life. That I'm always going to forget shit. In here. Bro, 
Or what was it? Oh, it was the bats. Oh, and this thing. Your aluminum case? Wait, can we hide stuff in there to get it through the metal detector? Check. Mm, okay, well. Or that's what Chris had. He had a lock pick. I think. <laughs> he had something useful, even though his inventory was shit. Okay, well, we can't use this for now, so I'm just gonna go store it, I guess. Still racking my brain on how the hell we get that fancy gun. Think he had the lighter? Maybe. Maybe it was Jill that had the lockpick. Honestly, would just make her that much better. Like a lockpick and six inventory spaces or whatever. She did. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I I concede to you then, Optijack. Jill was definitely the better uh <laughs> the better playthrough. I don't think I mind playing back-to-back -back like Mass Effect or The Witcher, and then you have games like Assassin's Creed, which has been a nine or so year journey. Yeah, I could not do Assassin's Creed back-to-back. -back. There's no way. I'm gonna leave the Navy proof finally, even though I feel like we're gonna need it as soon as I leave it, but especially in the remake. So wait, in the remake, do you play through like two stories? Oh, you mean the HD Resident Evil, right? Not like Resident Evil 2, 3, 4, not those remakes. Because they didn't do a full remake of one, did they? I don't think they did. Not that I remember. But honestly, I prefer the PlayStation 1 version to the HD. The Resident Evil HD. The, like, extra story yeah, and whatnot. Help me! Steve? God damn it, Steve. Uh, anyways... <laughs> Uh, I like the extra story and shit, but I was so annoyed by the fucking red zombies. Where is he? Is this like in Resident Evil where if you don't find them quick enough, they fucking die? Do you find in the remake though? Hmm. Seriously, where is bro? Oh, our heart's beating. Is this it? Oh, wait. Did he fucking go in there? He fucking went in there. He was suffering. There's a message. When two pairs complete, my anger will subside. There are switches? Oh god, uh, B and E? I guess? I don't fucking know. Okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ, so <laughs> Bro, give me them guns! Thanks to you. Looks cool, huh? Oh, I need those. Give them to me. You gotta fucking. be kidding. Voice acting, man. I'm keeping it. This is almost as good as Resident Evil Let's 1. Let's make a deal. I'll trade you for something fully automatic. See you around, Claire. Adios. Hey, wait, Steve! Wait, if I had the automatic guns, would he have actually traded them to me? Bro, I should just let him fucking die. <laughs> Gonna take my fucking guns. Ah. Uh, they didn't pay for voice acting at least the first five games. They just used the fucking devs to voice act. I would not be that surprised, honestly. Budget was 20, but they just hopped on Fiverr. You know? <laughs> Found the four cheapest people they could. Five cheapest people they could. And... Ooh. 
dare you interfere with my... Oh, audition. it's the incest bro. What are you talking about? You let yourself be captured so you could lead your people to this base. I have no idea what you're babbling about. You don't fool me. I am Alfred Ashford, commander of this base. Oh? You must be one of Umbrella's lower level officers if you're in command of a backwater base like this one. How dare you? <laughs> <laughs> As rude. The Ashford family is among the world's first and finest. My grandfather is one of the original founders of Umbrella Inc. Now tell me, why have you attacked this installation? Attacked? Shortly after you arrived, my base was attacked. You must have informed your people of its location. I still don't follow you. I really don't know anything about that. Unacceptable. How can you deny it? My base has been destroyed. And thanks to you, the experimental T-virus was released, creating countless zombies and monsters. Tell me. Who do you work for? Who sent you? <laughs> Have it your way, then. You're just a rat in a cage anyway. I'll be sure to keep you entertained before I dispose of you. <laughs> you British or German? Bro, I think he's just crazy. <laughs> I don't think... <laughs> Gertish, yeah. <laughs> He's just fucking, he's, I, I don't think there is anything there. They got a British person and told them to do a German accent. That's, <laughs> or maybe vice versa. I don't even know. Uh, I'm really curious now though, if we would have had the, uh, that fancy gun. The one that we've been using a little bit. If he would have traded this, that for the. For the gold akimbos. He's from Vermont. He just watches a lot of TV. Fuck yeah, dude. My favorite kind of VA right there. <laughs> it's all the incest. That's what it is, man. It just fucks with you after a while, you know? Weird that the dogs didn't come back, but I'm not complaining either. Like, that's fine. I prefer when zombies don't come back. It's fun whenever, like, the upgraded ones f show up or, like, <laughs> there's some, like, false sense of security and then one shows up or something like that. But whenever the same ones just keep coming back and back, I'm just not a fan of it. I was right, it was a bowgun arrow. Or, well, arrows. Uh, okay, this wheel looks a lot bigger than this. But maybe? Okay. Oh. <laughs> Bro, I thought it was like going in the top section there. Yeah, turn the steering wheel. Why not? <laughs> a whole ass sub just rises up. Okay, it's a little one. It looked a lot bigger from the first like image of it there. <laughs> sure. Let's go in a sub. That never ends poorly. lever maybe don't pull the first lever we side pack let's fucking go yes please more equip what is it just two extra uh i don't remember how many we had before if we had six or if we had eight before whatever we can carry 10 things now that's actually awesome thank you game all right well now we can pull the lever and hope for the best Wait, now loading? Oh god, what did this do? Okay, we went down. Can I look out the window? I don't trust going up the ladder, but I don't think we have a choice. 
Yes. Pray for the best. Oh. Oh, underground facility or underwater facility. Having flashbacks to sharks. Nothing. Okay. Oh. I'm not gonna lie, I like this. <laughs> I could play the hell out of this. I'm wondering how long this one is. What? How are there zombies down here? This place seems so secure. You're not dead. Get off. Now you're dead. Ribbon? And... That mean there's a save spot around here somewhere? Oh shit, you're already dead. Nothing. You can actually go through the door. I thought we were gonna have to find like a lever or something to open this. <laughs> Is that a seaplane? Bro, just dive down there and steal that bitch. <laughs> like, get the fuck out of here. Your brother's not here. Why are you still here? I don't trust any of this. There's another ladder. There's something up there. Okay, it's machinery. Not like a thing. Completely balked by the load. I'll give you a load. Uh, I feel like we need to hit that switch over there. This, oh. Okay. That was unexpected. Something worked. This is a lever. Move the lever? No. Let me... Uh, I can't see anything from here. Sure. Move the letter. It's gonna ask us a direction. I, I don't know. Oh, it's a fucking crane. Okay. I can do this. All right, it just completely takes it. I was worried it was gonna like stay there because um, I didn't trust it enough, man. <laughs> like I expected it to just drop on our face if it stayed there. The elevator iron bridge, the control levers. Guessing we need to find that. I'm assuming the, the seaplane is, like, our final goal, though. So we can just get the hell out of here. Although, I mean, we did email Chris, so maybe he will show up at some point. And... Oh, that isn't, isn't a ladder. The fucking uh, gate. Oh, good, it is still up. Lift may not operate if power levels are low. Are power levels low? Guess not, it operated. Dun dun dun. Maybe just run, Jill? Can I grab this stuff from over here? No, of course not. Um. Can you crush them? Oh, maybe. That's a cool idea. Nope. <laughs> Just no need to operate it anymore. Well. 
Reload the room. Not always, but sometimes this gives us better spawns. Uh, I want the Java zombie voice actor. I just want to moan in a mic. Okay, no, they're just... <laughs> they're just being friends over there. Look at them go. Look at all of them. They're just having a party. Bruh, just hop the fucking fence and grab this shit, though. I'm guessing that's the key, and that's more ammo. I'm gonna reload the room one more time. If that doesn't work, I'll just kill him, I guess. Or, well, shoot him. Why not kill him permanently? Yeah, no, okay. Just bad spawns. Bruh, <laughs> why? Why is it picked closest and not like most dangerous to shoot at? I haven't been counting ammo, but I feel like we're probably about out. Uh, no, whatever. I feel like that more or less had to be done. Take the bow gun ammo. For the weapon we don't have. We've been collecting a lot of ammo for guns we don't have. Biohazard card. Interesting. Card shining, a card key shining in silver. You can use this at the military training facility. Huh. For what? I don't remember seeing anywhere we needed that. Okay. I thought it was going to be the key for that door right there, to be honest with you. Huh. Well, fuck. Where do we go now? Oh, well, no, there is the other hall right here. We just went straight. Didn't go down this way. Something useful, please? Another save room? I wonder if the chests are linked in this game. Oh, fucking bats, dude. You fucks. I hate you all. I just want you to know. Oh my god. I'm gonna die to these fuckers. Uh. Roll system of some sort. Wait, what's a power? A boarding lift? Or... I don't think it's gonna be that simple, though. Apparently, a control panel for the lift. I don't like the way it says apparently. Yeah, it looks like there's three hexagons missing. Um... No... Okay. Oh shit, dude. I really don't know where to go. We haven't gotten anything new. We do have that navy emblem that we never made any use of, but... Oh hey, that's ammo. 
But even if that's like one of the things we need, there was clearly three spots there for stuff. Also, I'm bothered that the game gave us ink ribbons here, but there's no save point over here anywhere. Was there somewhere we needed a key card back at the military base? Maybe story thing will happen. What's his name? We'll start screaming again and then he'll give us them damn guns that should be ours anyways because he fucking would have died if it weren't for us. Uh, oh wait, lever, lever, lever. Yeah. How long is this game? On a car. Relatively short. 12 hours, that's not bad. I mean, it was going on the list either way. I was just curious. Uh, yes. Hmm. Okay. Yes, back to the mansion or whatever. Palace, they call it a palace. Anything new in the palace? I don't expect there to be, but we can check our inventory. Save the game, get rid of the extra shit that we're carrying. Bank ribbons, namely. we can't use a key card that I can't use at the moment and we have an empty extinguisher a combat knife play manual a case I can't open and the Navy proof which does appear to be the right shape for that control panel but of course we only have one not the three that it looks like we need Guess. Guess take the biohazard card with us. See if we can figure out what to do with that real quick. I don't expect us to, to be honest with you, but <laughs> we got a couple minutes left, so might as well run back to the other side of the game. And see if we get anything new or, or whatever. Wait, we won't even be able to take it with us all that far unless, like, some story thing happens because of the fucking thing. The, uh, the metal detectors. Huh. Maybe there will be a story that pops up. We need a key or a lock pick or whatever for the fucking briefcase that we found, the Dura Aluminum case. We don't know what the Navy proof is for. We don't know what this biohazard card is for. Oh, good. It's spawned us almost directly on them. Um. Oh, well, ran into that one. Everything else needs 
like emblems or codes or something to open. Silver emblems, gold emblems, badges, whatever the fuck it was. I think we're just kind of stuck at the moment if something doesn't just happen. Oh, we can take these now, though. Yes, take. That was it, right? Yeah. Mix or not to mix? Health's not that low. We have inventory space. I'm just going to leave it for now. Well, these guys are still here. That's good. Absolutely nothing over here to do. The store's blocked. The other way is just our guy that doesn't do anything. I mean, he breathes and we talk about how his eyes are closed. That's <laughs> that's all that's that way. Um, This is the dog area. I don't think there was any doors here, right? Other than the, other than the one, the the metal detection room. Yeah. I mean, the biohazard card probably isn't metal. There's nothing over there. That was empty. Well, not like empty, but a sealed room. There's no no doors or anything behind the gate. Mm, there was that one door that was being blocked from the other side. Maybe it's somehow open now. I guess. Guess just that, right? Yeah. Oh, these are broken now. Can we go through? No, okay. But the fact that they're broken now could be a good sign that there's something useful over here. Like an open door. I'll take everything, I guess. Uh, I'll just go through. Door or door is this room safe? Seems like it. Oh, it's still being held by something. What the fuck, game? You know, to Leon or not Chris, Leon. That's who we were messaging. Well, honestly, I think I'm stuck. And it's basically 3 o'clock anyways. We're probably going to call it there. Really annoyed that I don't know what I need to do. That bugs me. You're going to get me. You didn't get me. Get wrecked. I am very curious if it'd be possible to like to get them fucking stuck in the door. Oh god, we're actually like hurt hurt now. <laughs> uh ammo, ammo ribbon. Oh god, <laughs> is this it? Oh we're not dead! Let's go! Are you gonna come through the door or the window?
not like hiding something in here, right? <laughs> oh, okay. That would have been cool though. Like there was a gun that somebody put in there, but they never came and collected. Maybe a shotgun to go with that ammo that we collected in the other room there. I don't know. Oh, I should probably like equip a weapon. Should have also probably pulled the ammo out, but where's the fun in that? Run, run, run. Oh, that's right, there is this one. Yeah, we could use an herb, but I'm not really worried about dying because we done anyways. Doodle, thank you for the five more bits. There's that one, but we don't have a shield icon of any sort to put in there. there. The interest is just moving quicker. <laughs> Yeah, I'm stuck. I really, I honestly thought there was just going to be like a, like a story moment, you know? Like, bro was going to yell and then he would give up and give us the guns or be like, hey, I found this weird emblem thing. You can have it or something along those lines, you know? Nope. No luck. I do feel like whatever we need to be doing, it's probably in the palace area. I feel like this area is more or less until we we get an emblem to open that one room or somehow get that other door open. I feel like this area is more or less done. I don't know what else we'd possibly be doing here. And I don't think guy down here, this is the last thing I'm going to check. I don't think guy down here is going to do anything until we get uh, the like hemostatic medicine or whatever the fuck it is. I do believe we're going to have to come back to him at some point. But just not any time, like, soon. Yeah, he's still not moving or anything. This is the this is same. Same as the condition we left him in. Ah, uh, yeah, I don't care about the prison. Every fucking time I do this. No, there we go. Yep. Nothing. All right, well... It was fun. Honestly, really like it. Definitely going on the list of games to complete. I enjoy Resident Evil games, though, so no surprise there. Um, I'll be back tomorrow. We're playing God of War still, probably for another stream or two of that. Uh, after tomorrow, that is. I definitely don't think we're finishing it tomorrow. Should be starting around 5.30. Uh, it's a lot of fun. Been enjoying playing God of War again. It's been a while. And, uh, yeah, and then Baldur's Gate after that, and et cetera, et cetera. So, uh, have a good night, guys. Thank you for coming out. I do appreciate you all. And as, al as always, be kind to each other. Bye, y'all. Or can I, can I get them all to, like, come over here? Basically, oh, God, no, kitty, jump, kitty. Kitty jump! Oh god, we're dead. Oh god. <laughs>